Hey, it's Mark with FindingHomesToday.com, and I'm back with another question from a buyer asking about, do I have to put down 20% to buy a house? And we have talked about FHA and VA, and there's USDA out there as well, but I want to just focus on conventional buyer asking about the 20%, because that in the norm, when you're first learning to look for houses, you hear 20%, and a lot of folks get scared off and just stop their home search right there. But come back into the fold because you can actually put down as little as 3% if you have the right qualifications with your credit. And that's, I'll say it again, 3% if you have the right qualifications with your mortgage and your credit history or with your credit history. So typically people will put down the 20% because it does afford them the ability to not pay the uh, PMI, which is a insurance when you put down less than that, you have to pay that. A lot of folks will put down 10% or 5% to get a conventional loan, which is, again, fantastic programs. But for some folks that have the right kind of a credit, the ability to put down 3%, get into a house with a little closing costs in this market is absolutely fantastic. So if you need to learn more about those type of programs, give me a call. I've got awesome mortgage gurus that can help out. And with the home surf searching process, that's where I step in and try to help you out there. So please click like on this video because it does help the algorithms and helping other folks find videos like this. And click the bell icon on the subscribe as I am doing these videos just about every day answering your questions from both buyers and from sellers on how to help them with the home buying process. Again, it's Mark with FindingHomesToday.com. I'm here to help. Keep those questions coming and we will see you tomorrow.